This is a state-of-the-art £27.5 million recycling plant in Siam. Three million plastic bottles can be recycled here every day, over a billion a year. First, we need to get suited and booted. It's one of the most technically advanced recycling centres in the world. These bales of plastic bottles are fed in before being separated by rotating drum debaler. Labels are then removed before pickers manually take out any unwanted materials. The plastic is then cut into flakes before being shaped into pellets. So the bottles come in and they're, they're used, they, they're quite dirty, there may be some contamination, bits of metal or dirt or residues of drink and this plant is designed to deal with all of that so it's various bits of technology to separate out contamination, to shred the plastic down into small pieces, to sort it by plastic type, by colour and to end up with a pure plastic flake which is then melted to make a pellet which is food grade accredited, it passes all the necessary laboratory tests and it can go straight back into making a plastic bottle that we can all have confidence you know as consumers when we buy from the shops. Just a few miles away, another smaller facility will be opening in Washington, creating 130 new jobs between the two sites. I think everybody's been really worried about how we handle our plastic waste, quite rightly, and I think what this plant shows is that we don't have to export our plastic, we don't need to bury it or burn it, we can recycle it. And plastic bottles, which whilst they are I think we should we all accept we should reduce our consumption of plastic. I think that you know this shows that they've got a uh, a role in modern society and they've got a, a, a really important role to play in, in tackling climate change because they're low, low carbon, uh, very lightweight and very, very uh, durable. I think people should um, certainly put pressure on the shops they go to to understand about where plastic is being used unnecessarily. Where it is used for good effect then make sure you recycle, make sure you read the labels, you know, take the time and think about that. Um, if you get it into the recycling bin, you can have confidence it will come to plants like this and it will, and it will go back through the system. A lot of people, I think, are a bit distrustful of, of recycling bins and, you know, well, does it end up going anywhere anyway? I think they need to be reassured by looking at plants like this that you're actually supporting the green economy, you're supporting jobs in, in, in the UK and that can only be a good thing. Every person in the UK throws out 400 kilograms of waste a year on average. So will it be centres like this that change the way we think about recycling? Sophie Halsey in Seam.